here I am with uh, William and Jan. What's your company hey. name again? Global. 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 How do you spell that? G L U B B L E. It's French for Google. You're Dutch. I'm Dutch. Well, then, I'm English. English. Really? I am. Yeah, really. <laughs> for sure. Yeah. You're two founders. Yeah. And he came and up with the idea. <laughs> That's how it started. So right? what is it? Give me the two minutes. Okay. Pitch. <laughs> it's a brand new internet surfing experience for kids. Okay. Um, predominantly under 10. So it's targeted at giving kids a great experience on the web built around these things called globals. So globals are fun pieces of content, media, that are grouped around certain topics. So you've got a global for ancient Egypt and that kind of thing. So it's a way for them to, when in the browser, to experience all this great stuff and so it's fil away. filtering. Yeah, but in a positive way. What do you mean filtering in a positive way? Well, you know, it's a whitelist concept. It's a ah. whitelist concept, ah. right? Okay, so... So they can only go to those sites? Correct, yeah. What we do is we roll out a set of globals to start off with, and then parents can add and take away sites from those globals. They can create their own globals about their own content. They can share them with friends. It reflects the, their own social values, what they want, what the parents want them to see on the web, or what the family network wants them to see on the web. As a tech guy, you know, you understand the dangers the kids are facing. I've tried everything. When young children use the web, they don't look at 10 million websites, a million. They don't even look at 100,000 yeah. websites. So, so I just wanted a real simple way that the kids could just have the fun bit. I have three boys. I, yeah, I know yeah. what you're talking about. You How do you manage if I if I go on it and I start to putting bad sites as a global? It's The network's very small, right? So it's all based around the children. So there might be one or two children in a family and then they might have a network of eight or 10 people. And no one in their network that can add and take away sites from the globals is going to add anything bad, right? Because mm. it's their own family social circuit. So what are the challenges? And make sure that we get the product widespread and that we're able so to growing. localize the servers. Yeah. So who funds you? How do you find the money? I don't know, I've been pretty generous on the street around here. We, uh, <laughs> we've been asking around and whatnot. Yeah, in San Francisco you, you say you're doing a startup yeah. and people yeah. write you checks yeah, immediately. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. No, we're, we're privately funded with uh, some sort of, some angel investors that are dads themselves helping us out. We've got some, some good guys cool. behind yeah. us. Yeah. Like you. Yeah. you, you put your money, right? Yeah, yeah and I, I've put my own money in, but there's a lot of people. Cool, yeah, thank you very much, have a good weekend. Okay. Ciao. Does it? Is it working? It's working. It's working. It's working. It's working. All right. <laughs>